What's up, Yogi? It's Hero, and today I'm going to take you through three different exercises that's going to help you with hip flexion, so hip mobility, finding a little bit of core work, and external and internal rotation. This is going to be great if you struggle with transition stepping out or stepping in. Um, this is going to build all that, so we're going to jump right in. We don't need anything today other than a mat and your hips and your core. Getting started, you're going to plant your hands down by your sides and really focus on a straight spine. So if you're having trouble straightening out your spine here, you can always lean back a little bit. That's totally fine. Walk the hands back. First thing we're going to do is really press the heels down into the ground. Lift up the right leg as high as you can go while keeping your butt down. And then start to bend the knee in towards your chest and squeeze the knee in as tight as you can go. Again, I'm looking for a nice straight spine. So typically what happens when we draw this knee in is the low back wants to round. So if that's the case and you can't straighten out your spine from here, walk the hands back, straighten out the back and keep fighting for that knee squeezing in, okay? So you wanna do this about five times on each side is great. Each time, trying to fight for your knee coming in a millimeter tighter towards your chest. Okay? After you're done with that, we're going to work on internal rotations. So, and this is going to be great if you feel weakness as you're finding flexibility for your inner thighs, like triangle pose is a great example, or side angle, okay? or coming up into half moon. It's very similar. Spine nice and straight, hug the belly in, legs straight, lift up the right leg, squeeze the knee in towards the chest, take it over to the side, and squeeze the knee across your chest as hard as you can. Try not to lift the butt off the ground in order to find a deeper rotation. We're really isolating the inner thigh right here, so keeping your butt down is going to help out with that. Okay, Squeeze in, we're going to take it out. Squeeze in and take it out. Squeeze in about five times on that side. We're going to move on to the third exercise, which is external rotation. Same idea, but this time taking the knee over to the right shoulder. Straight spine, lift up the right leg, knee into the chest, slide the knee over to the right shoulder. If you're a little bit more flexible and you have more range in your hip flexor, you can squeeze the knee towards the wrist going down as far as you can go and take it back. Five times on this side, give these a try. Give me a thumbs up if you like them. If you have any questions, leave a comment. I'd love to answer any questions you got.